Hey, what is going on guys? Fully Bird here, back with some more WWE Supercard. So guys, we have some King of the Ring results. Um, we'll get over everything that happened in Ring Domination. And then we will go into the, the team Ring Domination, how it is going, and all that. So let's just go into this real quick. Nothing really to show you guys. Um, I lost in semis. I was just placing someone pretty good. And all that. Um... He had the Divas advantage over me. Because you know, guys, I don't have really good Divas. So that's kind of holding me back still. But, you know, we finished as the seventh seed. And we advanced the semis, which is impressive. Um, so I felt bad taking him out since he was the second seed. But it's all right. So Claymore War, guys, we have to get a pro. Um, you know, after Team Ring Domination, I'm going to have 26 Survivor Singles. So let's get a pro. A Diva would be amazing. Come on, baby. Hey, I take that. That's a single diva, but that's another diva. I would take it. I'll take it. I'm a little pissed, but you know I will take it. A diva is still helping. You know, um, I think that's like five survivor divas or something like that. One, two, three, four, five. Yes, yeah, so that's five survivor divas. Um, not too upset about that. I think I have all of them pretty much trained up. To be honest with you, I know Natalia has a couple more games. Uh, Alicia Fox has is done. Sasha Banks is done. Um, Nikki Bella has a little bit more games, but I'll end up training them myself with her. So when I start making the ring tomorrow, I'll throw Becky Lynch in there and then train her up. And all that good stuff, so that'll be cool. <clears throat> so let's go and set my King of the Ring deck real quick for tomorrow. That way I do not forget. Um, so let's put the Natalia in. Let's put her in. I mean, uh, Becky Lynch or whatever. Um, and then, guys, we will get into Ring Domination. How did I do? Yeah, I ended up finishing the whole Ring Domination. So, guys, um, I really wanted this Seth Rollins card. And I ended up having to spend, like, 1,300 credits near the end. I I had five shards with two and a half hours to go. And I said, fuck it. You know, I'm going to. I'm going to finish, I'm going to spin crazy and just try to finish this card. So I did, so I'm not going to get him from RTG. I'm probably not even going to spend an RTG. Um, we were getting into all that in another video, another video idea. Um, so I was kind of really excited. And then Team Ring Domination for the Tyler Breeze card. I really like that they premiered the Tyler Breeze card in this. So I have eight shards, nothing crazy. Um, the survivor is Dolph Ziggler, by the way, if no one knew that. Um, so we're going to chat real quick. Let's see what Haven got from his King of the Ring. Whoa, ended up hitting my mic. That's awesome, bro. So Haven actually um, won his first ever WrestleMania King of the Ring. And he got a Sheamus. Um, not too good of a card, but you know it is another single. Um, so yeah, we're going to set my King of the Ring deck real quick. Um, I have to change around some things. First off... This freaking Cesaro has got to go. So let's go to none. Um, let's go there. Um, and then what I want to do. Oh, hold on, hold on. What happened? There we go. Um, now what I want to end up doing is. Uh, I don't know what to do. Um, I'm going to do that. And then what I'm going to end up doing is I'm going to end up, I'm going to train out my Triple H tonight and actually like finish him off. And what I'm going to do is put Triple H in this slot. So that's actually, actually, hold on. I don't want Seth Rollins in, in this. Um, how do I want to do this? I'm going to put Kane right there. Actually, which Finn Balor is better? Um, yeah, I like this Finn Balor better. Um, so yeah, we're gonna end up. Sorry, guys, that's boring. We're gonna. I'm gonna end up seeing which Finn Balor is better. I think this Finn Balor is better by a couple points. Yeah. So we're gonna keep this Finn Balor, and then so now we got our full Survivor Pro tag. You know, um, these are pretty lit. Um, it's pretty cool having Rollins in there now. I love the ultra rare picture on him. Now, I actually don't 
have his epic card, which I'm really disappointed in, or survivor card. Um, so I'm not too disappointed that we actually got Becky Lynch. Not too, too disappointed. I'm a little disappointed, but you know, it's a diva. And I would definitely take a diva. Definitely 100% take a diva. 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 And you know, I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit while doing this video, you know. I've been doing super card videos for like a year and a month. And I feel like I've done it all. Like, I'm so over telling you guys what I got and what I'm going to do next. And, you know, I like doing that every now and then. But doing that every day is just not realistic anymore like it used to be to me. It's just so boring in my... Oh, my God. I didn't mean to drag him right there. Damn it. Um, you know, guys, it's so boring sometimes telling you guys what I'm doing. Like, the only exciting video is really to make... Are something like a what is it like a King of the Ring results or like a new event like that seems to be the only exciting freaking thing in the game to talk about and so you know I'm actually working on a couple of things and they're gonna end up taking a lot of videos like it's gonna take me a couple hours it's probably gonna take me like an hour and a half to two hours to edit each individual video that I'm actually gonna be working on cool we got a shard um, and I just want to do something different for YouTube for Supercard. Bring something to the table that a lot of YouTubers don't bring to Supercard. And, you know, I'm really excited. Like, I'm brainstorming so many ideas. And, you know, I got to jot them down, too. I, like, you know, when I'm at work and, like, doing my thing and, like, thinking, it's like... I have so many ideas for Supercard, and I really want to get them down. I really want to try to get on an upload schedule. That way you guys can get used to, uh, like, oh, Filthy's uploading on Friday. Oh, Filthy's going to upload on Wednesday, blah, blah, blah. Something like that. Something a little bit more consistent than what I do. Um, and, yeah, I'm just really excited about the future, about the new videos that I'm going to end up coming out with here soon. It's just really exciting, to be honest with you. Really exciting. Ugh, fuck, I want to take a card. There we go. Thank you, Lord. Alrighty. So there is AJ Styles everywhere on my team. Which I don't mind, by the way. They are everywhere. So let's try to get something good with these eight picks. Probably not going to get anything good. But let me know down in the comment section below, guys. What did you guys end up getting from ring domination did you guys get your gold did you guys get uh survivor bray why was the survivor bray Wyatt a pro for you it was not unfortunately a pro for me um you know i just had another single i had to get another single <sighs> Alrighty, guys this is going to be our last match i don't want to make too long of a video i need to get to bed it's actually getting pretty late here i wanted to get a nice video out though out for you guys for nice little grinding material i and an update on my pools. I haven't pulled a Survivor in two weeks. I haven't pulled a WrestleMania in two weeks. I haven't pulled nothing lately. It has been a dry spell. I think the highest thing I've pulled lately. I've pulled an epic charisma. I think I pulled an epic support somewhere along the way too. But yeah, I'm just not pulling nothing. And I'm not trying to let it discourage me. Because you know, King of the Ring. Even though they're singles, they have been good cards lately. Like, it's been no junk cards, really. Which I'm actually really happy about. There we go, a Seth Rollins. I'm excited to get that Seth Rollins trained out. I'm excited to put him in my deck, too. I really need to work on that Triple H tonight, too. 100% got to pro him out. Ooh, Tyler Breeze. That's another addition to RTG deck as well. My RTG deck is looking, gonna be looking tight. I'm really excited to see what the undercards are going to be. It would be tight if the WrestleMania card was a Ryback. Here we go. We pulled another shard. Another pick doubler. So I think that puts us at like uh, 10 shards for the event, which isn't bad. I haven't put no credits in it. I haven't played every bout. I was at work for a good while. Um. So yeah, 10 shards. Bill is tearing shit up right now. Whew, 20 shards. And then we got Big Good. 
nothing. Um, you know, since this is a pick dollar, we're gonna we're gonna have to play, guys. We're gonna have to play us. Alrighty, baby, come on, come on. <sighs> Rated R. I love that at picture points picture too. Such a tight picture. We're gonna put this Rollins in just so we can get some games. Now, if you guys didn't already know, I actually tested out the method. Um, let's say I put my survivor, or what? Let's say I put a card in here in my team deck that I want people to train. Now, I've asked other people to use the cards. I've actually used the cards on a different account on a team member's account. Um, when other people use your card, it does not train it up at all, which is surprising. It's crazy, right? Um, for some reason, it won't train it. Um, you have to use the card in the team event for it to get trained. But I think it's the opposite in Team RTG. I swear I tried it in Team RTG and it worked. So who knows, but just a little disclaimer. I put Rollins in just for the hell of it, just because I wanted to train him up and just because he's an awesome card. He's probably my favorite card I've ever gotten in Season 2 besides the legendary Seth Rollins. Besides. Definitely going to try to bring as many Rollins over to Season 3 if, as I can. Definitely going to try to. But guys, that's going to wrap up today's video, guys. Thank you all for watching, guys. Don't forget to smash that like button, guys. And subscribe, you guys. You know, it really helps me out a lot. And I really appreciate the continued support, guys. So, guys, I'm for the bird, and I will see you all later. You guys have a good day at grinding, and uh, RTG preview should be up tomorrow or Wednesday if Cat Daddy's feeling lazy.